Yo, what is up guys, Noodles here with my 500 subscriber Q&A video. And uh, we're going to go ahead and start this off. In the background, you will be watching me finding tubes for the two-spot showcase that I have on this channel. And at the end of this video, I will show you two spots from this map. If you want to see the spots before I talk, you can go ahead and skip it. And let's go ahead and start this. All right. So we had Jed Tanko. Why are you so good at BO tubing? I I guess it was just a new thing for me. Tubing was a new thing, so I just I used whatever I could to just find something. And not much people played Black Ops 2 for tubing back in the day because they said that the tubing sucks. And so I was like the only one who actually did it on BO2, and then. I started to grow with the BO tubing. Um, he also asks tips on finding better spots. I guess be creative and think outside the box. I have a spot on a studio where there's just this bottle on the floor and I shot off of it and the tube flew pretty freaking far. So just things like that, just little things, just shoot at it and see where it goes and if you go like far away and shoot at it, see what it does. That's basically what I do. Am I planning to join tubing clans or going solo? Why or why not? I don't think I'll be joining any tubing clans soon. I think for me, tubing is just a little thing that if I go on Black Ops 2, I'll just do randomly because it's the only thing that I'm good at, to be honest. I can't kill anyone. So, I mean, I, I did hit this spot um, a month ago, just randomly playing Black Ops 2 with uh, a buddy of mine. And I'll show it in the background right now. It was an actual pretty nice Nuketown tube. It just goes outside the map for a little bit and then comes out and catches some guy. It's pretty sweet. Ninja Frog asks, when does the third episode of Style come out? The third one should be out in less than a month. Because I also have to upload Squishy Muffins, which I, I got destroyed in. And Ninja Frog, you destroyed me too. I'm just kind of sad about that. I, I guess I was tilted that day or something. Excuses. Will you ever upload our old SARP gameplay? I, I don't actually know if I have our gameplay still. Actually, I think I do. But they were mostly the, the showcasing of the maps. But I don't think I'll upload that anytime soon. I have a bunch of series that I have to do. So we'll see you, man. Where did the term Pizzerinos come from? So, uh, two years or a year ago in the summer in Wisconsin with my uncles and them, they used to always put Renos after something. And then one of them said, rest in Pizzerinos. So I just used Pizzerinos out of that at the end of every video after that. So it just became something to me. Did you answer my question for? There is no question for. <laughs> okay. Do you prefer spaghetti or macaroni? Spaghetti. Do you hate that I'm asking random questions? No, no. It's actually pretty nice, man. And uh, he says, congrats. Extra tubing asks, can I be first question? Oh, my bad. You're not first question. Do you like playing BO3? And do you like it? I... I've only played Black Ops 3 for a few days and I don't really like it because I guess I'm just so bad at the game. So, yeah. Dope Boy Chris asks, do you still tube? I only tube when I have the chance to, but most of the time I just play Rocket League and uh, chill about with my friends. WWK Cobra asks, who is your favorite tuber in the community? Now that's a very hard question because I admire a lot of people. But if I had to choose, it would have to be in a, a fairly decent BO1 Black Ops 2 tuber. Like someone who is really creative. So let me try to think. Man. Because like, the people I admire quit tubing around when I quit tubing and that's when I just like didn't really look at tubers 
So I guess the one that is existing right now has to be... Oh, man. Logic. Alright. The next question is from Optic Lechuga. Hashtag Mexi. Can I be in your Q&A? Yes, you can. That was, a, that was a really hard question. Fogo asks, Can you love me right and how many ducks does a duck duck? Can I love you right? I can love you wrong. And a duck ducks nothing because my aim is on point, brah. WBS Globes asks, Am I the baby noodles? You are some person. You are yourself. And do you have a sister? If so, what age? I do not have a sister. Sorry. I'm Panda asks, Are you black? Nope, I am African American. Zero aka Longshot asks, How long do you plan on doing YouTube? And will you upload more frequently in the future? P.S. Congrats on 500 subs. I plan on doing YouTube for as long as I can. Because basically it's just something I just show my content to people and give them entertainment that way. It's just not really not really a, a job for me. It's just a hobby and a hobby stays with me as long as I enjoy it. Will I upload more frequently? I plan on to. I have a lot of series that I'm doing. Just this week was a hectic week. That's why this Q and A is out really late. So, and the last question for this Q and A 500 subscriber video is from Nugget. Did anyone in particular inspire you to start the YouTube scene, or was it just for a fun hobby? It was. Mostly for a fun hobby, I used to upload a bunch of videos when I was a kid, like really, really young, I don't know. I just found YouTube and found that you can make an account and upload videos and I started doing that. And there's this really old video on an old channel of mine that I'll show in the background right now. It's just me, I'm like, I'm probably like, shoot, 10, 10, 11 years old or something with a spider. And then for all of you guys who are new, I love spiders, so here's just a little video of me holding a spider. You guys are probably creeped out now. So thank you all who asked questions. There weren't that much questions. I was hoping there would be more. Not much people even saw the video, so I'm kind of uh, sad by that, but that's okay. Um, thank you all for 500 subscribers. That's just amazing. I started, like, I mean, a few years ago just having a camera in front of me and Modern Warfare 3 clips but now it's just grown to a lot of people enjoying my content and a lot of you guys are respectful too which I really love and I hope to keep this going on for a while so thank you all again and I'll catch you guys later I lied I'm going to commentate these spots real quick for you guys hope you guys enjoy these spots for the first spot on the offensive side, you're going to go ahead and run into this corner that I show you here. And look up, there will be this cloud with a little dent on the right of it. You're going to put your right cross here, just in it, and then go ahead and shoot. And it's going to give you this really nice aerial kill cam almost across the map. And it'll catch people either running to the stairs or running to this corner. It's pretty nice. On the defensive side, you're going to go ahead and go into this corner. And there's going to be this little dark patch in the cloud right there. You're going to put your foul cross there just as they do there. Like a pixel under the dark patch. And then go ahead and shoot. And this one's going to give you a nice dome shot right into the pathway. And if you guys enjoy this, go ahead and like this video and comment down below if you guys want more and subscribe as well.